hello today we'll be seeing a um, collaboration diagram in star uml to create collaboration diagram uh, i'm choosing an empty project you can go on with the default approach also but i'm choosing an empty project and because our topic theme today is going to be bank management i'm going to rename the title here as bank and then to create to add a diagram to create a diagram basically we need to create a model inside the explorer we have given and then inside the model i will be creating my collaboration diagram i'm going for collaboration diagram and not a collaboration diagram rule it is different specific uh, other elements uh, compared to simple collaboration diagram so simple collaboration diagram this is the interface on which i am creating my diagram so i have um, because the theme today is bank management i'm going to uh, interact with the objects of a bank management a user uh, atm and a bank what are all the things that are happening around it so i'll create an object as the user and another object as the atm or a bank and have another object as bank so basically these are the three objects which are going to interact um, collaboration diagram is also known as communication diagram because we will be specifying what and all communication happens between them so here we can link these objects using link there is self link also so i'm linking them i can have an interaction uh, between a user and a bank through account or some other thing or an atm or an user and also between an atm and a bank we can have any uh, kind of interaction so i'll be having a forward stimulus that is from user to the atm that is my forward so i'll be naming it if i'm going to insert a card i'm going to tell the atm that i have inserted the card or the atm is going to tell me that i have inserted a card to insert the card and um, a user can directly link with a bank through an account account information if it want if it wants account information and all and so so if i have inserted a card the atm will notify the bank for no i have a forward stimulus from this so i'll notify the atm bank notify bank that it has recognized the card that the atm has sent the details of so like this we can have reverse for example i have from bank to atm from bank to uh, if i have atm i have one more stimulus so i can say that the transaction has been successful so update the balance so like this way we have to create the communication that happens between each and every one of them so i have already created a sequence diagram which notifies between a customer atm and a bank here i am emphasizing mainly on an atm which will be interacting with the customer and a bank so in case i insert my card and the atm is going to notify the bank and then the bank is going to notify the third that is notify bank here we can see that the communication is sequenced accordingly so if i have an insert option next i'm going to notify and that is going to be my uh, second one third is notify then i have my fourth communication as once it has been notified back to the atm i'll be asking the atm will be asking the pin so the customer is giving the input as pin so once the fourth option is pin the atm is asking for authentication that is the fifth one six once it notifies back the session starts that is the atm and the customer so like this way we the communication is sequenced in the collaboration diagram so here we have 
sequence and then I'm authenticating then I'm specifying the amount and then it is checking for confirmation and checking the availability and then once the action is confirmed the operation is successful and I'm going to update the account and database and then I'm going to intimate the change to the user the, and the ATM is going to display the balance and then it is going to return the balance to the bank and then when it is going to return an end session the customer closes the session so this collaboration diagram can also be made uh, through a sequence diagram uh, we already have a sequence diagram here we have model inside model we have convert diagram that is convert sequence to collaboration so here I'm going to convert my sequence diagram to collaboration diagram. So once I convert, click, click the convert, we can see. So this is the selected. Okay, so I'm going to convert. So here we can see that the uh, sequence diagram which is inputted here has been converted using model of convert diagram this is a simple uh, method for converting a sequence to a collaboration diagram but here we can see that all the methods are jumbled and angled up so we can just organize it so that it is clear so through this way we can convert a sequence diagram to a collaboration diagram so this is the explanation for collaboration diagram in star uml thank you for watching